yeah, um, well, I'm in a different timeline where Doc is kind of, his head's kind of a bit, I don't know, but let's mess around with him. Most of the time he's headless. Sometimes he's kind of okay. That's just freaking disgusting. Uh, so let's test out the DeLorean. You know that gizmo you've got hooked up to the DeLorean, the crawler after an analyzer. Yeah. Well, what am I supposed to look for again? A signal that is done evaluating the time circuits. The analysis can take a while. Be sure let me know when the light turns green, and I'll take her out for another test run. How can any of these people take this seriously? This is creepy. Look at Edna. She doesn't even care. She doesn't even care if his head's a freaking pencil. Well, let's, let's test out this baby. The DeLorean. Hey, the lights are... That's good news. You need to tell. Uh, oh. Ew. Well. Wow. Okay. Well, let's, let's get Doc to ride the, um, like the DeLorean. So me... Hey, Carl. I'm sorry, Miss Baker. Call me Edna. Me. I don't want to waste any time. There we go. I pressed Your the button. Your chronometer's gone green again. Ah, time for another test run. Miss Strickland. Go. I shall await your return. I would be a bit worried too. Now we can see the flux capacitor clearly. It's good. Yeah, I don't know how I got this to work. I just started talking to him, and then his head just kind of stretched out. So, uh, yeah, that's pretty disgusting.